<laughs> One that shall never end. These guys are funny. We are busy talking about how to restore Biafra nation. And they are busy invoking the edict to go after those that will stop it to be from being president of Nigeria. My question should be this. Are they evoking the it is for Buhari? Or are they evoking the it is for Fulat Janjawi? Or are they evoking the it is for uh, P2B's enemies? We should be truthful to ourselves. We should be straightforward and stop wasting our time. And I agree. P2B may win this election considering that the people love him. And they believe he can do a good job to make Nigeria a better place. But the question is this. Do you think all these cabals will allow him to be president? They are evil. They have already planned what they are going to do. Just wait and see. Now, without wasting your time, let me go ahead with the news. Enugu community invoke deities for P2B's veteran in 2023 election. Dr. Eze, followed with four other elders of the community, invoke the deity to go after anything that will stop Ubi from winning the election. Resident of Ubelago, Omana, in the Ezegu local government area of Enugu State, have invoked their deities to raise up against any force or power that would hinder the presidential cabinet of the Labour Party, Mr. Pitobi, from emerging as the winner of the 2023 general election. This is coming a few days after an Enugu Catholic priest and spiritual director of the Adoration Minister, Enugu, Nigeria, Father Mbaka, came under fire for declaring that the former governor of Anambra State could not be Nigerian president because he was a stingy man that cannot give people his memory, money. Now, Mbaka had also said that if he was one representative, it is not someone like P2P be because he is cursed. But in 5 minutes 29 seconds video seen by Sahara reporters, the chief priest of Alose, Obelogo, Omana, Dr. Eze, fellow with four other elders of the community, invoke the deities to go after anything that would stop Ubi from winning the election. Fellow who spoke mainly in Igbo language said he did not know Ubi in person. But what he was doing was a directive from the spirit of his God, and therefore prayed to the deities to take over the federal government for the victory of Ubi. He said, I, that is a fellow, one of Ibulogo, and my cabinet members have gathered together today. The great AKD to declare that it shall be well with all the Igbos. Our declaration today is for P2B. We declare that P2B will be our leader. He will be the president because Igbos do not love themselves. Our prayer today is that Igbos and the deities of Obelago should rise up and we are in Ezago land today to declare that P2B we embark on this journey and no power of man or woman will stop him. All the evil and wicked men will fail. I, Dr. Eze, fellow, one of Velago, and the elders are in the land of Ezago today to declare that our prayers must work. We invite all the deities in our land to rise up in battle and bring back our right. We do not know who Peter B is, but what we are doing today is a spiritual thing. It is what my spirit told me to do that I am doing. The spirit of our deities, we call on you 
to rise up and go to the federal and they get our right as we call on you physically is the way we call on you in the spirit like I said before Peter B might win the election but the question is that are these cabals going to allow him to be Look, we know that Janjawi will never allow P2B to be a president. They must do something. They have already started doing something by bringing in people from outside the country. They are not tripping in into our land. This was what Buhari did before he became a president. In fact, this was what made Buhari a president. And those people are the people are in our land today causing havoc. People that are not from our place all of a sudden, they have turned our land into murderous land. And because they are in, on a mission, the soldiers are aiding them. This is why, or should I say, this was why Buhari refused to allow any other tribe to head the military or the police. Because he knows that they will find out what he has done. And that is why they have continued to torment our land to date. So what makes you think that these people will allow Peter B to be president of Nigeria? Know that he may win if they do not ring the election. But believe me, they are going to ring it. They are going to do everything possible to stop him. And this is why we are saying that restoration of Biafra is the best thing. We have been in it, on it, for some time, and it's already coming, and now you are talking about presidency. But like I said before, someone like me will not tell anybody not to vote for P2B. But the truth should be told that the restoration of Biafra, we will never forget that. I think I've come to the end of this news. Please drop a comment in the comment section, share this, and remember Cheers.